Hey guys, Justin Pickup back with another video for you today. Just wanted to let you know something pretty exciting we've been working on for the past few months. It's something that's been readily available, but it's becoming more and more common. That is property guarantor loans for investors. The notion is usually that it had to be for owner-occupied. You live in the property, which we can do. This notion essentially works exactly the same as if you're gonna live in the property, or also if you're gonna invest in the property. What is a parental guarantor and how does it work? Essentially, you can use one of your parents' properties or relatives' properties, depending on which bank we go with, as a security in order for you to get into the market. And that can be to you for you to live in or for you to invest. What this does, is it basically allows you to get in with no deposit and avoid the lender's mortgage insurance. You can chip in a bit of a deposit if you want, but it means more money in your back pocket for another purchase or something or rather later on. Let's use the example, we're gonna buy a property for $400,000. We need to get a 20% guarantee from somewhere. 20% for $400,000 would be 80 grand. Now that guarantee can come from your parents' owner-occupied property or from one of their investment properties if they've got any. They can have the mortgage on their property, there just has to be enough meat in the property in order for them to give you that guarantee. If your parents' place is worth a million bucks and they owe $200,000 on it and we need a guarantee of only 80K, plenty of equity in that property in order for the banks to do so. So what that looks like for you is that if you buy that property for $400,000, you'd have two split loans. You'd have a $320,000 portion and you'd have an $80,000 portion. So it's all 100% financed under your name, but you're getting that guarantee from your parents. So the bank says, yep, we're actually willing to lend 100% on this property because we've got that guarantee, that security from your parents' property. What that would essentially mean for your parents, no money changes hands. It's generally just a caveat on the title from the bank saying, hey, we've got an interest of $80,000 on this property. If they were to sell it or anything like that, that would be something that pops up. The ultimate aim for this is it's a temporary measure in order for you to get into the market. And let's say this property goes from $400,000 to $500,000 and you're now sub 80% loan to value ratio, you can then unsecuritize your parents. And there's a couple of ways you can do that. So obviously the markets do the heavy lifting. If you're a handyman or you do a renovation, then that increases their value or you pay that portion off that $80,000 or guarantor portion off as quick as you can. What that will do benefits wise for you is it basically the Banks assess you as if you're doing a 20% deposit, which means you're not getting the LMI rates and that's a cheaper interest rate for you. You're avoiding that lender's mortgage insurance. On a purchase of around 400,000, that could range from say five to $10,000. Some lenders will let later put the stamp duty on top. You might wanna pay that up front as a bit of a medium. And if you've got any kind of solicitor's fees, you know, pest and building reports, a buyer's advocate if you use that as well. It really allows you to cut that cost down, avoid that lender's mortgage insurance, get into the property market sooner. It is somewhat of a daunting conversation of saying, hey, mum or dad, can I use your property as guarantor? If they've got a good you know, knack of investing, they understand what you're trying to do, you're buying a property to better your position, and you know if they've got plenty of equity in their property, it's something that could really help you out without actually exchanging cash. If you wanna have that conversation with your parents, if you want some information, we've got some really good information we've popped together, the lenders that we use and how that process works. If you're looking to get into the market, you're obviously building your careers and you're you know, projected to go up and we've got no issues with credit and there's a good trust between yourself and your parents, it is a really, really good way to get into the market. If you wanna reach out, you wanna run the numbers, have a look at the scenario, please do. It's a really, really effective way to let people into the market without costing them an arm and a leg and also without having to save that deposit which can take a long time depending on your financial scenario. If you want to look at those options, get into the market a bit sooner, feel free to reach out and we'll give you a hand. Cheers.